So we have, uh, like I mentioned, uh, Marsha from Gus. Gus showrooms provide a high level of detail and an extraordinary freedom of movement in the virtual environment, creating an engaging experience for virtual visitors. And now with the shoppable integration, your customers can easily purchase directly from your virtual storefront. Uh, Marsha's fun fact, uh, this is so fun. I let her use it twice when she <laughs> was 17 years old. Uh, she took flying lessons to become a private pilot. Uh, and she even flew solo from LA to Santa Barbara uh, as part of her training. That is incredibly impressive. Uh, Marsha, um, next time next time you present on, on Space Jam, I'm gonna pull another fun fact from you, but that will do for now. Uh, let's get into Cello and Gus and your uh, fantastic new integration. Okay. Well, you guys, again, my name is Monsha and I'm with Gus Technologies. We're in Italy near Venice. And we're excited to share with you our new Cello application for virtual retail stores. So basically, Cello integrates um, Matterport technology and Shopify to, um, to create a digital twin of a retail store. So basically, it, we designed it to be very simple. Um, it has two functions. It has the viewer function and the editor function. And I want to go ahead and first show you the user experience um, by going through the uh, digital twin of the retail store through the viewer function. So by clicking on viewer, uh, we're actually accessing a real retail store in, um, in Northern Italy. And basically, as you walk through, you see the Matterport scan of the store. And we have all the matter tags. Whoops, sorry, you guys. We have all the matter tags for the items that are available for purchase. So we can actually click on a matter tag. And over here, we um, see the items loading from our Shopify store. So these are all items that are in our Shopify store with their prices, with their sizes, their colors, if they have colors. And if we decide we wanna buy something, we can actually add it to the cart. And this is our shopping basket um, from Shopify right over here. Um, let's just um, go ahead and go into maybe another item. We can see the, let's say the clothing items. And again, we could um, decide on a different color or a different size and put it into our basket. Uh, of course, as always with the matter tag scan, we can walk into the other uh, room of the store and we can decide to add a bag to our shopping spree since today we can buy lots of things. And once we're ready, um, let me go ahead and go up. Once we're ready, we can um, check out through Shopify. So this is our Shopify basket of our Shopify store. And if we click on checkout, we can actually go ahead and put in all of our shipping information and then continue to shipping and pay for the items and actually purchase the items through Shopify. Now, um, I wanted to take the time to show you guys how easy it is to create a oops, here's my mouse, to create a matter, uh, associate uh, an item from your Shopify store to your matter tag. So if we actually go into the editor function and we access the scan of the store, uh, we can identify maybe a rack of clothing that doesn't have a matter tag right now. So if we go ahead and we I'm sorry, you guys, but I have the, um, I can't click on my icon because I see the things from Zoom. So let me try to move it. Okay. So basically I can click on place a new tag. I can put it on my, um, on my rack. And then I can click on that icon and it takes me to all the items that I have on my Shopify store. So this is a list of all the items I have on my Shopify store, and I can actually choose the items that I wanna put on this matter tag and click save. And basically this matter tag has been created right here on the bottom as a new tag. We can actually go ahead and name it and maybe create a name that um, is useful to us. Hanging two, four, I don't know. 
And then once we go back to the viewer, we can see the matter tag we just created very easily. So it's working and ready to go. So basically our viewer function, our editor function lets us create new tags, edit existing ones or delete tags that, are, um, that we don't need anymore. And um, basically this is our application. Does anybody have any questions or? Um, We've got one question in the chat. They said, are these purchase options available to any developers using the API or only on Shopify integration? So they are available to anybody using the API. If you don't already have a Shopify account, you can create a new account and load up all the information. You do need to have a Shopify account to be able to make it work. Makes sense. Great, Marsha, a second question. Um, is this self-serve or does Gus provide services to get retailers up and running? So we designed Cello to be self-serve and, e and easy to use. And so to start a new digital twin of your store, you can upload a Matterport scan. If you don't have, um, if you can't make your own scan, you can use the Matterport's capture services to actually have your store, your retail store scanned. And then from there, if you already have a Shopify account, you can easily create the matter tags to link the products available on your Shopify store and use your Shopify store account to let customers check out. Uh, we're also planning to make Cello available on various marketplaces in the near, near future. So, um, and then if you don't already have a Shopify account, you can create a Shopify account and use like an Excel file to load all your inventory, including images and things like that. So it's fairly easy to use. Uh, we're always available for any, su any support you might need in um, getting started and getting your digital twin up and running. Awesome. Thank you so much, Marsha. Um, really great uh, next steps for Gus with the Cello uh, solution. And thank you for showcasing today.